Hi, I'm Vicky Ross and welcome to Personal Development 365 Days. Today we're going to talk about confidence. What a lot of people don't know about confidence is that the opposite of confidence is fear. When we don't feel confident about something, we feel fearful. So when we're looking and when people say to me, Vicky, I want more confidence, what they're experiencing in that moment is fear. And what, to, what you have to do to overcome fear is number one, acknowledge what are you feeling fearful about. In other words, is your preparation ready? And the thing that you need as well, over and above of just acknowledging the fear and checking with your unconscious that yes, you are prepared as best as you can be, is you've got to be courageous. You've got to be brave. You've got to go out there. So when people are asking for confidence, really what they're lo looking for is to be more brave, is to be more courageous. So in order to become confident, you have to be competent. And this is the checklist. This is where you say, am I ready? Am I prepared? If you're doing a speech and you want to be confident in your speech, you have to make sure that you are prepared, that you have gone over all the information and that you've practiced delivering. The next thing is that you have to be brave and you have to think about what are you there for in order to get that courage. And the courage comes from knowing that this is not about you, but this is about somebody else. So when you're giving a speech and you're feeling fearful and you want to be confident, you need to acknowledge that you are ready, that you're prepared, and that you're there to actually give information to people that don't have it. And then you're there for to help them. And therefore you need that courage in order to do that. Perhaps the confidence is about walking into a room. So again, the fear comes in because you're not ready. You're not quite sure who's going to be there. And perhaps you're not quite sure about what you're going to say or what you're going to deliver. What kind of message you want to give across about you. So again, acknowledge that that is what you're feeling. Imagine what it will be like to walk into that room. How do you want to express yourself? How do you want people to receive you? And then be courageous enough to just go and do it and be yourself. Trust the process. Trust yourself. So next time you want to be confident, ask yourself, what am I scared about? What do I need to do to be more brave, more courageous? So enjoy that and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.